Okay, so I'm here today to talk about exams. First of all, the midterm exam scores, they have now been successfully all posted to uh, Canvas, right? So take a look for your midterm grade there. Uh, I've also set it up so the, um, the final exam grades, once they're scored, will also automatically post to Canvas as well, all right? So let's talk about the final exam. So there are 100 questions on the final exam. Each question is worth two points, so it's a total of 200 points. There are 58 questions from the second part of the course, which is chapters 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 13. So 58 questions from there. And there are 42 questions from the first part of the textbook. Now, these 42 questions from the first part of the textbook, you've already seen them because I took them right out of the midterm exam. So uh, 42 questions from the midterm exam, just copy them, put them right into the final, and then 58 questions that are new. But uh, these are questions you probably have encountered as you made your way through the, all, the, uh, all the assessments that you had to do, right? So uh, I'm not saying every question would be there, but most of them should be. The uh, <clears throat> other thing I've done for you is there's no time limit on the exam. So take as long as you want, but there's only one attempt. So you only have one attempt to take it, but take as long as you'd like. There's no time limit. The other thing I've done is I've made it happen so that if you have the ebook, that you can actually uh, get hints from that. You can also see at the top of the question uh, what chapter it comes from and the uh, part of the textbook comes from. But if you have the electronic textbook, you should be able to link your way right over to that, to that part of the, of the text that has the answer that I'm looking for, okay? So a couple of things to make it easy for yourself. Um, after you take the test, you can find out how you did, but you won't be able to check the question, the actual answers until after the exam period is over. So you may take the exam starting at midnight on Sunday, April 20th, and you can work uh, and you can take the exam all the way up to, uh, it closes Wednesday at midnight, okay? So you've got basically three full days to take the exam, you have one attempt. So get ready and then take it. But you do get hints uh, that you can get, actually you can go right, use the textbook kind of with the test, all right? So that's it. Uh, I um, think I've graded everything except, I'm gonna get to the uh, air pollution one uh, today. And then the other two assignments, remember the other two assignments, which is the water quality assignment about lead in water. And the other assignment is about fracking. Those are not due until Sunday night at midnight. So remember, if you realize what I did, I extended those. All right, so that's it from here. I hope everyone is staying safe and staying well. And that's what you need to know to take your exam. So good luck, and we'll talk to you soon. I'll send you another couple of messages uh, before the end of the term. All right, take care.